guys, it's uh, Fire Phoenix 151 and I'm going to do a let's play on Endless Ocean 1. So, well, g'day there. Welcome to Manoa Lay, pride and joy of the Pelago Commonwealth. Now customs need your information, so let's start with name and gender. So my name is Ashley. So I'm going to go ahead and put that in. That's a splendid name, that is. But I'm not sure we got your picture right, so let me ask a few more questions. It gets fair hot down here. What kind of tan are you hoping for? Let's just do fair. Yes. I could have guessed. And now let's check your hairstyle. How do you like it? Uh. What does. Wild look like? Yeah, that's good. Uh, let's do brown. And that looked kind of weird, so I'll just do black. Yep. Crikey! I think that says, I may have to give that one a go myself. Eh? Oh, sorry mate. This one tends to ramble a touch. Yeah. Right, so we're all square then. Well then, that wraps up your Im immigration procedure. <laughs> Manoa Lay offers many of the South Pacific's greatest diving locations. Take your time and explore your to your heart's content. I just know you're gonna love Manoa Lay. Have a great time, mate. All right, so we'll just enter the empty one. So, here we're going to start learning how to use the controls and just get on with diving and start the storyline. And just to let you know, I will be doing an LP on Endless Ocean 2 after this one is over. Test! Test. Hello, can you hear me? I'm your partner. My name's Catherine Sunday, but you can call me Cat. I'm here to give you advice and help you in whatever you need. Manoa Lay is an awesome place and there's tons to learn, but first we've got to get you up to speed. So let's go! Okay, first things first, let's take care of the basics. I'm going to run you through directional control. Yeah, so let's have you turn to the north. Use the compass, yeah, whatever. Okay, I'm gonna do this. So, there we go. And bingo, looking good. Okay, now try turning east. Let's do easy again. Okay. Hey, knights, you turn around a lot because you're a pro. Ha ha ha. Yeah. I think you're ready for the next step. Let's try swimming. You're going to need to kick your fins. Swim straight ahead. Okay, so. Let's... Yeah, I know where B is in case. Well, there it is in case any of you didn't know, but I'm assuming we all do, so. Let's swim straight ahead. I mean, we can't click on the fish quite yet, but we will later. And we got a good view of the lagoon. This is the lagoon. It's a small sea wall, sea, <laughs> salt water lake located on the west side of Manoa Lay Island. This is a good little place for viewing tropical fish. Okay, so head east until you reach the center area. So let's swim over to the center. <clears throat> About right here. Great, that's good right there. Let's see, what else? Oh, I almost forgot the auto swim function. It's the way to go when you're covering long distances. But only the most skilled divers can even attempt. Can even attempt. Huh? You can do it? Awesome. Can you show me? 
Now auto swim, I usually don't use that much because I find it perfectly fine to just hold down the, the, the B button, but I guess it would be good for traveling long distances, but... Wow, what's up, dive pro? That's a great technique for getting around without any hassle. Or for being lazy, I guess. Anyway, you look pretty comfortable down there. I think it's time to have you come back to the boat. Go, go ahead and, and make your way to the, back to the Gabbiano. Okay, so now we have to return to the boat. And, yeah. Gabbiano. Small but sturdy vessel. Gabbiano means seagull in Italian. In case any of you wanted to know. already, huh? Did you have fun down there? Kinda gets lonely out here, so it's nice to have company. So yeah, my job is basically to protect the ocean and all its creatures. And that's where you come in. I can't do my job without a type without a top diver. <laughs> what? What do you do? That's the easy part. Mostly you just hang out and dive whenever, when you feel like it. Well, that's a good job. Although we get specific requests from the Marianas Foundation sometimes. They provide our funding, so you should probably oblige them. But you don't have to. I know, pretty laid back, huh? I think I'd go crazy if I had to work in an office. Yeah, probably me too. Oh, sounds like we have new mail. Say, why don't you go in the cabin and check the mail? Okay. So here it just tells us how to walk around on the boat. Uh, yeah. So let's go in and check this real quick. This is our cabin. It's full of gear and maps and all that jazz. It's basically our nerve center. You'll need all this stuff eventually. But right now, you can only use the mobile device, dive log, and clock. Don't worry, the other stuff will be available soon. Okay, so... Yeah, so currently we have the time, the uh, mail, and the save log. So let's go ahead and read this really quick. Yep. Okay, greetings from Alfred Thorman. Uh, okay. Uh, let's just read this. Okay, you are familiar with the coral forest, yes? Well, we would like you to perform a brief topograph topographical inspection there. Simply dive to the coral forest and wait for instructions from Catherine. So there's no, no hurry on this. Please take your time. Yeah. Alright, so now we have to go to the coral forest and do some stuff there. So... Go back. And I cut scene again. The coral forest is just west of here. Here's a map to help you complete topographical surveys. You can press 1 to view the map. You can now use the map. People say it's gorgeous. What, me? No, I've never, I've never been there. Why not? Oh, you know, uh, I'm pretty busy and I have stuff to do and I, I can't swim. Look, it's just one of those things. I don't really want to talk about it. Well, that's okay. We all have our weaknesses. Alright, well, let's dive. Yeah, and here's just the different kinds of music that you can get, and you kind of unlock them throughout the game. <clears throat> right. Hey, do you know a lot about fish? They're kind of my specialty, so let me help you out. I can be your fish whisperer. Sorry, lame joke. <laughs> anyway, fish take center stage in the ocean. 
let me teach you how to examine a fish. Okay, so let's go up to one and push it. Okay, so let's go on this little guy. So now you can pet it. It's probably. So yeah, here you can read the information and uh, these little things. There are also other bits of information, but you can only get them separate times in, dive, in uh, separate dives. So when you come here again and you focus on it, then you'll get the second piece of information and so on. But I'm not going to read that because, yeah, we don't know much about this guy yet, but that's where you come in. Okay, so we'll learn more about it. Uh, big honor, interacting. <clears throat> so there's quite a variety over here. What are these guys? Green chromuses, I think. Yep. And there's food. Oh yeah, food's another good way to... You just have to press A and it appears. And then the fish start eating it. And in general, the underwater creatures, you can become familiar with them. You may not even know what they're called in the beginning, but you'll learn tons of interesting things as you become familiar with them. Check them often, okay? Yep. You can see that you know your way around. What? How did I know? I put a small video camera on your tank that lets me see everything. It's just for safety, silly. I'm not going to follow you around or anything. Anyway, the cruel forest is west of here. I marked it on the map. You can check it out with one. Well, um, I'm not going to do that in this part yet because we're kind of running out of time, so I'll just kind of see some of these fish and show you guys some of them. Okay, this is taking forever. Okay, Emperor Angelfish, uh, Powder Blue Tang, guessing... Let's try food. Uh, nah. Well, apparently those fish liked it. Okay, well there they liked that. No, not the emperor angelfish over here. Peter made better fly fish. I didn't even know I got that. Okay. Ooh, manta ray. These things are awesome. Very cool. Manta ray. And these fish always disappear. I think later it's because there's a little microscopic area, but remember I used to always try to focus on those fish and it would never let me, but Manta butterfly fish. Wait, is that a see a Yellow tang. Come on. I don't know, it was probably just one of those. <laughs> oh, there's the yellow tangs. So we're kind of running out of time, so um, in the next part we're going to go into the coral forest and see what there is to find there. So we'll see you then. So bye.